What's the crack? Welcome to today's episode. My name is David Kelly, I'm the Irish Guy Vlogs, and in today's episode, I'm going to be taking it a little bit slower and I'm going to be giving an update on what's to come with the vlog over the next couple of weeks, months, and even further down the line. So, I said a while ago back that I was going to be making a video on Sketry Island, and I am. I'm planning it. I am planning it. The thing about the video is, is that the more research I do about it, the bigger the video actually becomes, and I, I quickly realized that I, I'm gonna need a budget for this or some kind of sponsorship or something like that to be in place for me to make this because it's gonna be a decent sized production, there's a lot of logistics involved, There's I need other crew members and so it's gonna need more than me on the crew. I'm gonna need transport to and from the island, I'm gonna have to feed the crew, give them a place to stay while they're here and as soon as I kind of realized this I just put it on the long finger because I don't have the money right now but I will make it, I will make it, I'll find a way somehow because this documentary has to be Med. it just has to be so if you're wondering why you haven't seen it yet that's why I am working on it I'm planning it slowly but I am planning it and I'm still writing the script for it and it just keeps on getting longer and more details and history that I need to confirm or deny or whatever but it is being made and you will see it I just don't know when but I am looking for sponsorship so if you know any companies or events or people that want to have their name tied to the documentary drop me a comment down below and uh, let me know and thanks so you might have seen my video from last week I made a vlog with two of my nephews and it got great response people loved it if if you haven't seen it you can watch it here. I thought it was really funny and I had such a great time making it. And I will be bringing back one of my nephews for a video in a couple of weeks. It's it's a type of video I, I've never met before so surprise surprise there is planning involved but if I pull it off it's going to be such a funny video. Stay tuned for that. It's going to be funny, it's going to be good, slightly dangerous but safe dangerous if that makes sense. Simulated danger but stay tuned for that because it will be up on the channel in a few weeks time. I'm just planning it but it's going to be good. I'm trying to think of other updates. Oh, my geocaching video. So you might have seen a few weeks ago that I did some geocaching. I went up around Kilkee, the cliffs, Loop Head. Again, you can watch that video right here. And in that video, I said that I was going to be planning a larger geocache. And I am. I've ordered stuff from China. I've ordered like waterproof boxes and stuff like that. They're on their way from China right now. There's five in total. So it's going to be like five caches that connect together and bring you on a journey. And it's going to be awesome. I have a story in mind. It's going to be really cool. I just have to talk to some people to make it official so that I can leave the caches in certain places that tie to the story. And if I pull this off, it's going to be really cool. It'll be a nice little thing set up in town for tourists to come in and just have an activity to enjoy in Kilrush, which I think will be really, really cool. That's also being planned and it will be up and my friend Neil has agreed to help me with it so he'll probably be in the vlog as well and also I owe him a pound of butter because he was the first person to find my geocache and I still have that competition running for a pound of butter so if you're interested and you want and you find the geocache and you're first to find it you'll get a pound of dairy gold butter not a bad prize if you ask me and uh, yeah there's probably going to be some official award ceremony with me presenting him with the butter and stuff like that there'll be media and stuff there it'll probably be on the news in every newspaper and stuff like that it won't be any big deal to be honest and while I'm here I want to give a shout out to a subscriber of mine so a few weeks ago back he contacted me out of the blue uh, he commented on my Kit Kat Chunky video which if you haven't seen you can watch it here but he commented on my video and said I think you need an animation and I was like what? so a couple of hours later he sent me an animated version of my Kit Kat Chunky video <laughs> which I was blown away by it was my first piece of fan art I'd never received fan art from anyone ever so to me it was it was flattering it was like so nice it was just a really nice gift to get I'm gonna leave a link to his channel in the comments down below his name is Artsy Kid I would really love if you could send him some love subscribe to him or like his video whatever you want to do but i was just blown away by just the generosity and that someone took the time out of their day to make me something from the content that i made for them it was just awesome so thank you artsy kid if you're watching this i really appreciate the video and hopefully i can send some uh, some new subscribers your way and yeah thanks for the video and i think that's it for now i think that's all the updates that's everything i can think of anyway at least sometimes i can get a bit overwhelmed by the, by everything by the amount of ideas i have and then sometimes i can get kind of put back by when i realize that i have this awesome idea but i don't have the funds to make it or i don't have the context to be able to get the thing i need to make it or whatever it is you know but i'm only nine months into this process you know i started youtube back in january it's a big learning curve for me even though i knew how to make films and videos and stuff i'm still learning so much and the journey so far has been amazing like i've loved every bit of it and the final thing i want to say in today's episode is thank you thank you for watching thank you for liking subscribing sharing commenting for interacting for everything you do to help my channel grow i'm at almost 200 subscribers now 
Back in July I was at 100. I'm not going to make a celebration video for this because it's going to be very, it's probably going to be very similar to my 100 subscribers video, which you can watch here. <laughs> but, <laughs> but it means the world to me that you're here, that you're here watching my videos, that you like them, you share, you comment. It just makes me want to keep going. <laughs> and I'm feeling kind of emotional now because... Uh, When I first started back in January, I, was, I wasn't even expecting 200 views. You know, I started YouTube with the idea that this is going to be a creative outlet for me. Back in July, I was at just over 100. So the growth from then to now is just amazing for me. It's like my, I feel like my channel has exploded. I know it hasn't, but like the fact that 200 people watch my videos, that, you know, I get such a thrill out of knowing that people like my stuff, that people want to come back and see my latest video and... I can't thank you enough for that feeling. The only way I know what to thank you is to keep making videos and that's what I'm gonna do. My next big celebration video will be at 500 subscribers and then for my 1000 subscriber video it's gonna be mental. I, have, I, I already have the video on my head, I, have, I know what video it's gonna be for 1000 subscribers, it's gonna be a crazy video. So the sooner I get there, the sooner you'll see it. But thank you for being here, honestly it means the world to me. And if you know anyone that you think would like my channel, just get them to subscribe, you know? Give him the old elbow and be like, hey, this oh, is not bad. He's, he's, he's grand. Yeah, that'll do. I'll, I'll take that review any day. So yeah, thank you so much for watching, for subscribing, for being here. I'll see you all again next Friday with another video. And yeah, take it easy. Bye.